the top story today is one on the Carrington event super flare of 1859. It was the last super flare produced by the sun, and if it happened today, our way of life would be over. These are expected every 150 to 200 years on the sun. This one happened 164 years ago. The new estimates put it at about an X80 in terms of flare power with a possible range of X46 to X126. Their best estimate and their top estimate make it two to three times bigger than the largest flare we've ever seen with satellites, which was the X40 event back in 2004. We know it's only a matter of time before another one erupts. We are in the red zone time window for it right now and in the next 20 to 30 years, not to mention the bigger flare possibilities up to X1000 flare events. When it happens, every grid will catastrophically fail. There will be no power, no internet, no phones, no gas, no banks, nothing. We'll be reset back to the basics. Given the way the world is going these days, it's a trade I'm betting some of you would take. I instantly get a rock hard erection just thinking about a coronal mass ejection spurting from our brightly shining star. As a species, we've got our heads up our ass. We find ourselves in a mighty impasse. There's no way out but to get help from afar. With one ejaculation from our sun, human folly will come undone. It's the only way to nip the blitzkrieg in the bud. When the geomagnetic storm arrives, the electrical grid will be completely fried, leaving us with blank screens before our eyes. So you better drop your smartphone from your grubby little hands and quickly make some alternative plans. Your comfy world will go right out the door. The lights will go out and the shells will be bare. The taps will run dry and you can't go nowhere. Oh, the toilets will fill up with piss and shit that overflows. I'm expecting a coronal mass ejection. It's the best way for nature to make a correction. The human experiment will have finally shot its wand. You can kiss your sorry ass goodbye. The cosmic forces don't never lie. The zombie apocalypse is coming down the pike. I instantly get a rock hard erection just thinking about the coronal mass ejection spurting from the brightly shining.